Hello, this is Zoe Esplin Wright, and this is Enhancement 4. So, um, first of all, I'll show if we look up localhost and go to the products page, you can see it, it delivers the product management view here. And then we can select from add category or add product. So, first we'll add category and Let's just do uh, another test and we'll say test one, two, three, add category. And if we go here in the database, we can see that it is added here, test one, two, three. Um, and so let's go back here and this time we can go to the add product. And as we can see, because it's empty, it says please provide information for all empty form fields, so let's just do enter these things. And add product. And again, brings us back to the product management page. Um, so let's just validate the CSS and HTML. Product managed page excuse me, product management page, the HTML validates, no errors or warnings. And the CSS validates as well, no errors. Now if we go to the add category page, CSS, no errors, validates. And HTML, also validates, no warnings or errors. And lastly, oh, I guess we'll, no, if we go to the product page and there's no error for the CSS that validates and the HTML validates, so. One thing I wanted to show as well is if we miss some, so let's just say we'll miss stock. And then add product, it wants us to fill out that field as well. So they are all required. But anyway, this is my enhancement for, thank you for watching.